dear students we are in jee mathematics and we are in the chapter of applications of derivatives today we are going to solve questions from 2023 year 2023 from question number 49 to 54 we will do and we will close this chapter today okay tomorrow we will start uh, indefinite integration of okay. continuous calculus we will do okay see let the f 0 1 to open interval r mapping b function defined by f of x is equal to 1 by 1 minus e power minus x and g of x is equal to f of minus x minus f of x okay consider two statements g is an increasing function in 0 1 g is 1 1 function in 0 1 we have to see whether both statements are correct only one is correct or two is correct both are not correct that like that four options are there that options are not written let us uh, proceed okay see function shall i rewrite that function see i am rewriting one minus see e power minus x means i want to write like this okay then e power x minus one by e power x Is it correct? e power x minus 1 divided by e power x. And we write denominator is numerator. Okay, this is f of x. Then go for f of minus x also. Comma I am keeping. Okay, comma. f of minus x means directly you keep minus here. Then 1 by 1 minus e power x. Why? Because minus I have kept. Now you write g of x. G of x. G of x is equal to firstly f of minus x power x. That means 1 by 1 minus e power x minus f of x. e power x by e power x minus 1. See, if you observe denominator 1 minus e power x, e power x minus 1. If I take minus common, this is going to become plus and 1 minus e power x it will be. Okay? Let's write it. That means g of x we are doing. See what we are doing. 1 by 1 minus e power x plus e power x by 1 minus e power x. Is it okay? Minus I have taken common. Minus. That means this is going to become minus. This is going to become plus. This minus is going to make this as plus. Now see the denominator is same. LCM like. That means see 1 plus e power x by 1 minus e power x. This is g of x. Okay, uh, now we start. What they are asking? F they have given, G they have given. Consider two statements. What is the statement? In both statements, they are considering only G. That means you forget about f of x and f of minus x. You have to consider only this 1 plus e power x by 1 minus e power x. That's all. This you consider and apply 0 to 1, whether increasing function or not function. Uh, what we can say? Increasing function or not. How can you say? See, you differentiate first to g dash x. g dash x. See, u by v. v d by dx of u, u e power x minus u d by dx of v minus e power x. Well, you can see e power x you will write but outside minus is there. That means I want to make this as plus and e power x. Divided by v square. 1 minus e power x so 4 square. Okay. Okay. Now make that f. See e power x if I take common g dash x is equal to e power x if I take to common 1 minus e power x plus 1 plus e power x divided by 1 minus e power x whole square see here e power x e power x if you cancel what will happen this is going to become 2 into e power x by 1 minus e power x whole square g dash x see g dash x you have to submit 0 to 1 then we can say whether this is increasing or not okay see second thing g is 1 1 means how you are going to know we know one, one formula x1 is less than x2 and f of x1 is less than f of x2 then 1 1 okay this strategy we know as per this strategy what i can say i don't take 0 i take like that only 1 by 4 okay see 
1 by 4 is less than 3 by 4. Now I am applying this uh, 1 by 4. See here, now you go here. 1 plus e power 1 by 4 by 1 minus e power 1 by 4 is less than 1 plus e power 3 by 4 by 1 minus e power 3 by 4. It should be definitely okay. Why? Because this is always greater than this term. Okay. Therefore, 1 1 also. That means the both statements are correct. Okay. Let us go for next question.